Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Hard Enduro Media. End of day two, extra on 2019 here in Portugal. And I'm with part of the JM Racing Crew. Welcome, guys. Matt, first. How you doing? All good. Dom. You all right? I don't know about you, all right? All right, mate. Very good. Thank you. Thanks for uh, having a chat with us, guys. It's been a good day out there today. Now, I'll, I'll chat with Dom first because we got some GoPro stuff last night, didn't we? And yeah. uh, quite interesting stuff there. Tell me about it initially. Um, well, we've got the video of Matt trying to ride through the reservoir. Everyone knows about me, so they're... <laughs> 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 that was um, that was a bit interesting, wasn't it, Matt? Um, and then skied his bike and ended up in the mud. So yeah, that was a good one. Um, and then a few over the hills. Yeah, yeah, all good stuff. Tell me about that, Matt. That little that little clip there. Where we just uh, we've just been watching. Now we'll re we'll, we'll rerun it, but. Uh... Yeah, bit, yeah. bit stuck there, a bit, bit tied up. Right, well, what happened was, it was like a dry riverbed, and I saw a bit of water, and I thought, it's quite a dusty day. So I thought, you know, to keep the dust down, I'll go and send it through that. Um, yeah, it wasn't one of, one of the brightest ideas. Um, tried to go out the bank on the other side, that was about this high, but it went in the mud and then straight out the bank. So it was basically on me at that point. And I, I thought, oh, so I had a second bright idea after that, which was to ride it a bit further down, and it, it just went deeper and deeper and deeper. And uh, yeah, we had it stuck above the front tyre <laughs> in a bog, basically. <laughs> yeah. So how long were you there trying to get it out? Uh, I don't know, probably 10 minutes. Yeah, I mean, no one wanted to help other than Dom. Cheers, babe. But uh, yeah, all the other lads wanted to just watch because, yeah, it's, it's stunk. It was horrible. So. We are busy providing moral support to see that, how good a job you are doing. <laughs> now, I did notice your bike is a KTM, but it's blue. So you are... Known as the, the Yamaha factory racing, is it? It's, it's not actually a KCM, it is a, it is a Yamaha. So, yeah, it's the WR250 goes really well. <laughs> Yamaha! <laughs> and Dom, <laughs> Dom yeah. I, just, I was looking at some of your stuff last night, and um, Tommy and Darcy, Steve Davis would be really impressed, wouldn't he? Yep. Yep. The 2020's down. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, they, they were doing really well. They were doing really well. Together. It's like your cryptic comics and telling them how to do things and they're getting it all wrong. Technically, that's the best. Because I've not had to turn it. No, you are going to have to now, though. No way. No, no, you're all good there, aren't you, love? Do you mind? Yeah, please. <laughs> I think that's the best riding. Right. Straight in the front wheel the other way. Straight in the front wheel the other way. Put the other way. The front wheel the other way. No, that's my clutch. Sorry. That's a river. Is it? Yeah. Right. Why I, come down, uh, I advise you don't follow Darcy's route. I yeah, they, they tend to not, li not listen, so, you know. If they listen, they might make up some stuff, but they haven't done very well. They've left us today, so we don't really know where they are. They got back very early, I think. Yeah. Tell me about today. How's the day gone? Yeah, really good. Not as hard as yesterday. Definitely a lot easier. It was, um, yesterday was difficult. We had a big group, but we shrunk down a bit today. A bit faster. Um, but nowhere near as much tight stuff. We came oh. back down the M25 from last year. That was quite good. Yeah. Got any clips of you? Just tell me about a couple of clips. Uh, yeah, jumped out a tunnel. <laughs> which was quite fun. About six, what was it? Five foot drop off, four foot drop off. Yeah, that yeah, was quite good. Um, yeah, it was the only one to do our chicken dip. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was a bit sketchy, but it was all right. Um, what else did we do? A couple of hills. A couple of big hills we went up. Yeah, it was bait, really. What did you think of King's Line, Alex? You know, the first thing this morning, going over that rock, sort of rock yeah. formation on top of the hill there. Yeah, that was pretty relentless, really. Just give, didn't give the arms much rest. Good, uh, good warm-up straight in, in the morning, but... Um, yeah, it was a relief to get to the end of that, and uh, it was good. That was a good line. What what sort of what's your highlight of today? Um, it's all good, really. I was quite relieved for an easier afternoon compared to yesterday. I had, I had doubts of a, uh, but um, yeah, no, it, it's all good. Today, some good high uh, climbs, good a few good downhills as well. Um, tight, twisty, technical stuff. Um, you yeah, know, it's a good day. All in all, a good day. Enjoyed it. Well, it has been a bit of a shorter day, I and mean, we'll back up. Me and Mike were back early. Me and Mike have had his own sort of escapades as well. It's been quite interesting. I'll show those uh, at the end of this film. But uh, thanks for joining us, guys. I'll be catching up with everybody else, Tony. 
uh, Darcy and Tommy at some point, but uh, thanks for that. We'll be back very shortly with our next, next guest. I'll see you soon. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. I'm now with my next guest here, and it's Petra from Austria. How are you, Petra? Thank you. Very fine. <laughs> our Petra's English is not brilliant, but hopefully we should find out some interesting things today. But before we talk about this event, I've seen you at some other events this year. Tell me about where you've been. Uh, well, I drive some races in Austria, the hardest uh, you can get there, uh, except the Erzberg because it's uh, really, really hard and there is so much traffic jam and I don't do it again. <laughs> uh, it's really for the tough guys, it's too hard here. Yeah. And uh, I was in Sea to Sky. Yeah, that's where I saw you. Yeah, it yeah. was really nice. I preferred uh, the tracks and the uh, distance and everything was really nice there. Yeah. So what made you come to Portugal for this event? Uh, we saw it on the internet and uh, we are just three people just to find out what it is and check it out and just to see and it's uh, pretty nice, yeah. And who have you travelled here with? Uh, we came by plane and one guy drove with the van, the bikes with. Uh, is it Andy who's brought the bikes? Yeah. Andy Hertel. Andy Hertel. Andy Hertel, yes. He's the best for this. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we've, we've seen you on the course riding today and we saw you yeah, really? riding yesterday. We have a couple of clips. Okay. What do you think of the terrain here? It's perfect. Uh, it's uh, a little bit other than at home, and uh, it's very stony, but uh, it's uh, kind of different. It's really nice, yeah. And how long have you been riding? Ooh, <laughs> I'm riding now since uh, 20 years, but uh, in the middle I got the babies, and uh, now the kids, uh, two girls, they are uh, seven and eight. And now it's uh, my second career. <laughs> have you brought your children with you this no, week? No, no, no. They have to go to school. <laughs> Only mummy has holiday. <laughs> well, it's really nice talking to you. It's really nice to see the ladies taking part in, in these type of events. So thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, see you. <laughs> back shortly. Harry Duro Media, Exron. See you soon. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. I'm just with the... The Canadian now. This is uh, Julie. Now, your surname is it Hods? I've... It's a long story. It was Paul Ellis's idea to call me Yods. That's where it all comes from. Its middle name is Yodok, and then it just became Yods. So it's Julian Yodok Hare. Right, that's a mouthful, is that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is. And there's too many Julians. That's the problem. <laughs> yeah, Julian Rappin, Julian, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, we met last year here. At, uh, it was Madron, and you're back, you're helping with the, the organization here. Mm -hmm. How's it going? Uh, it's going pretty smoothly this year and everything like that. Uh, today, you probably noticed it was a bit of a shorter day. Uh, tomorrow's going to be longer again, and then fr um, Saturday will be a little shorter again. And yeah, it's just with the, the change in the ISDE, we just decided to make it four days. And yeah, and I hope you're enjoying it. Robbo, you seem to be anyways. <laughs> We saw you when you came in a few minutes ago. You said you felt like you'd been riding with square wheels. Yeah, yeah. Yesterday went really, really well, and today not so well. Uh, you got footage of my uh, my whole slave cylinder being cracked in half.